All right, Lisa here again, and I just wanted to show you a walkthrough of my December setup. I'm gonna start using this planner tomorrow, so I'm super excited because it's very cute and it has pink in it and it just makes me happy. So it's a good combination of um, Coco Daisy, um, and I'll mention the other shops as I kind of go through. But um, I did a video um, on my channel and it shows you how I made this binder because I made this with just patterned paper and lamination sheets and a ring binder mechanism, which you'll see once I open it. So I have a video on that, you can check that out. Anyway, so here I have a nice little um, charm, planner charm. I have this felt um, poinsettia so pretty. I contemplated putting this here only because it covers my art that I did on the cover, but I love it. So I did it anyway. And then when you remove it like this, then you can see um, the art that I did. And I explained all of this um, in another video. So we're just going to open this up and see what's inside. Um, it's going to be so fun planning in this. So I have a couple of four by six um, journaling cards in here from Coco Daisy. Um, so I just have these in here for now and as I need them or want to add photos to them or any type of memories, I'll punch them and I'll put them within the page. But I have them here for now. And then I have the um, planner clip from Coco Daisy in here, their snowflake sticky notepad. And I have another notepad right here. Tis the season to be busy. So this is going to be fun to use. And then I have, I used part of their inserts and then part of my own Dutch door inserts. So I'm not sure exactly how that's going to work. For sure, I'm going to keep this page, this December tab and the monthly page that's here. Um, but when I get into the weeklies, you'll kind of see um, it's a little bit out of my normal. So I'm not sure if I'm going to do it or not. I'm not completely committed. We'll see what happens tomorrow. Anyway, okay, so then I have my Hallmark Channel holiday movies because I love the Hallmark Channel. I have a little notepad here from Papery Love. And then these little notes, um, little sticky notes, are all from Daiso. And I thought it would be good to have this expenses one on here as well. Like as I start shopping for Christmas gifts, maybe I will keep track, maybe I won't, who knows? But it's a good idea. And then I wrote here notes um, with the um, puffy alphabet from Coco Daisy. So I think that came out really cute. Nice little spread of um, beautiful sticky notes. <laughs> okay, and then some library cards are in here. Um, and this is from, gosh, I can't remember right now. And then um, here's, I used a metal die to create this pocket from Coco Daisy Paper. So that came out cute. And then here I have these again. Um, I'm gonna have to see what I'm gonna do with them, but they're part of the Coco Daisy um, planner insert. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I mean, I really enjoyed last month doing the I'm thankful for um, journaling prompts. So maybe I'll find something that's similar for December. But I, I did really like this. Okay, so then I just have a little thing, little snowman charm down here, a Coco Daisy um, paper clip bow, some um, really cute die cuts. These are not from Coco Daisy. These are from, I'm not sure if it's Felicity Jane, if it's Studio Calico, or which one, but it's one of those. Here's the vellum from the Coco Daisy kit, and I um, went ahead and I put the holographic overlay on it just to make it pretty, but it's still see-through. You can still, it's still transparent, but I thought it would look really pretty if it was sparkly. <laughs> All right, let me go into our monthly page, and then this is when I go into my weeklies. This would be my first week um, going into December. I believe December 1st is Thursday. So what I did is I'm using um, the Coco Daisy um, B6 insert here, and then um, which is a vertical insert. And then I went ahead and I added my Dutch doors in here. And before I printed them, I went ahead and added some Coco Daisy artwork to them and printed directly onto my Dutch door. And so um, this will be Monday and then um, Tuesday, Wednesday, so on and so forth. But then I'll also be able to see my week at a glance up here. So what I'm missing from my normal style of planning is a decorative box that goes right here. And then the continuation of my lists on this side. So I'm going to MacGyver it somehow um, to create the list and all of that. But I just, I liked all this decoration and it was like halfway there. And so I thought I would try this kind of um, 
mixture of planner pieces and see if it's going to work for me. And then again, an acetate piece here to mark my current week. And I like using acetate because it's clear and it doesn't interfere with my plans. Um, but, you know, of course, you add a little bit of glitter and it just makes it pretty. So I have um, all my weeks here ready to go with a note page, note page in between each week. So that's kind of fun, especially when you're Christmas planning. Um, I think it'll be fun to have those. We'll see how, how it turns out. And then I have some little pockets here. I put some journaling cards in here that I might need throughout the month. Um, some Coco Daisy die cuts. And so I just punched these and put them in here like that. And then here's a Coco Daisy quote card. I believe it's Coco Daisy, I'm pretty sure. Um, and then um, just a couple of the daily to-do lists from the Coco Daisy planner kit. Um, just a couple of them. I didn't put too many because I noticed that my binder was already getting chunky and I hadn't even started <laughs> in the month. And then um, today I made this super cute pocket. So it's decorative on one side and then it has the pocket on the other side. And I just think it came out so cute. I love this slit because then you can stick die cuts in here or things like that. I haven't done anything with it yet, but I did stick um, some planner stickers um, from Papery Love, some decorative stickers um, with a holographic overlay. And then I made another passport folio. I made this out of the Coco Daisy um, paper and I used, I can't remember if I used my silhouette, my cameo, or my brother's scanning cut. I think my brother's scanning cut um, to cut this. And then I'll show you what's inside right now. But anyway, I did this and realized that the hats were upside down. But don't tell anybody, okay? Did you notice before I mentioned it? <laughs> All right. So anyway, I just put a, um, a, what do they call this? A chipboard sticker on here and with the right reading. That way maybe your eye wouldn't notice that the eye, that the hats are upside down. But anyway, um, in here I have, so I was telling you about the papery love washi tapes. So the washi tapes are great, but what I like to do is put a couple of the boxes from the washi tape onto release sticker, sticker release paper so I can see the designs because these are somewhat transparent when they're on the roll of washi, it's hard to see. And not only that, but if I wanted to use this one, for example, but this one was the next one on the roll. You know, I'd have to cut this off. You know, this way I have my variety. I can pick what I want to use. I can see it. And I also like to write my plans while it's on this and then place it um, into my planner. So I like doing it this way. So these are the full sticker boxes washi. And then the quarter boxes, which these ones are all the same. Look at how pretty they are. And I don't know if you can tell, but they have like a silver um, hollow. And then these are the half boxes. Just so cute. And again, these come on washi rolls, but I put them on this sticker release paper so it's easier for me to see and decorate my planner. And then I just stuck them here into this little folio. And then I stuck this little folio into this pocket like this. And then the same with this. Then I took um, the Coco Daisy acetate sheet, this snowflake one, and I layered it with some patterned paper and stuck them together, put a die cut here, um, a bow clip there. I used the pen holder from Coco Daisy um, on here, stuck this on here with the matching pen. And then this is from a different Coco Daisy kit, but it's red, so I figured it would work. And I just really like these sticky notes. I mean, they're so cute the way they look like a ticket. So I really wanted those there. And then um, another little die cut, another paper clip that I just tucked into this um, vertical pocket. And then um, my little notepad from Coco Daisy, a little chipboard sticker. And that is it. That is my December setup. Um, it is gonna get significantly chunkier with the photos. So we'll see how it goes when we get there. But, um, I'm excited about this. I think it's going to look really cute on my desk. I'm excited to start using it. I'm going to work out these sheets and I'm also going to see if um, this particular setup is going to work for me. So I'll let you guys know at the end of December how this worked out <laughs> and if it changed. But anyway, so there's that. I hope you like it. Please comment below, like the video if you enjoyed it, and I will talk to you really soon. Bye-bye.